Hey, what's up, fellas? How are we doing? Matt Tanelli here. Today we're looking at Charlie Culberson of the L.A. Dodgers um, fielding a slow roller, one-handed, and we're going to talk a little bit about his technique, a couple of things I think will help you guys out. And so here he is in normal speed or slow motion. Boom, got the out. So let's talk a couple about a couple of things he does. First of all, when you're fielding a, a slow roller on the run, one-handed with your glove hand, you're going to field it outside your body, outside your left leg, okay? So you can see him here, outside his left leg. Glove is open, exposed to the ball. He feels the ball just as his left foot is coming forward. Now you see the timing a little bit different depending on the guy. But he's going to get to the left of his body as his left foot's coming forward so that he goes right, left, right, throw. And again, some guys will be a little bit quicker. They may feel that um, with their right foot coming forward and then it's left, right, throw. But a couple things to keep in mind. Once you field the ball here, you want to bring the ball to the middle of your body so you can transfer just like you would on any ball, right? So we always talk about bringing the ball to the middle of your body regardless of fielding position. And you're going to see the same thing on a ball where you're going to be charting and playing on the run. So he brings it to the middle. He breaks thumbs down. Short arm action, right? He's going to throw with a little bit of a low slot here. So his... That relationship we've talked about before where, you know, as your arm slot drops down, your head is going to be, you know, down with it. And so the relationship between your head and your arm stays the same. The more you come up over the top, the more your head will be this way. The more you come and drop down, the more your head will be this way. All right, so that relationship kind of stays the same. The other thing you're going to notice is when he throws, he's throwing the ball this way, but he's running this way. So what a lot of players do is they try to get around the ball, which takes a little bit too much time on these slow rollers, and then they try to run in the direction that they're throwing. The way to be able to get the most on your throw is to basically play right through where the ball's hit. So he's running this way, throwing that way. Much easier to throw you know, with more velocity and more accuracy, accuracy if you do that. It's one of those things where, you know, you're always teaching players to get the momentum going through it towards their target, right, on, on regular ground balls. But this is the one play where you don't really want to do that. You don't want to get around the ball and get yourself going towards the target. It's much more awkward to throw as you're running <laughs> right at first base. So just think about quickly attacking the ball and then running through where the ball just came from and throw. So again, field off your left foot, bring the ball to the middle, break thumbs down, short arm action. You can throw from a little bit of a lower slot and continue to run right through where the ball was batted. So let me know if you guys have any questions in the comment section below. Subscribe to the channel if you've not done so already. Give the video a thumbs up, share with all your friends. I'd really appreciate that. Check out our Instagram, Matt Tanelli Baseball, our Twitter feed, Matt Tanelli 9. We're posting videos all the time for you guys. And that's all I got. Thanks again for watching. I appreciate it. And we'll talk to you later.